This is video number two. One, two, one, two, one, two. This is going to be a collective thrift accessory haul of shoes, bags, belts, that type of stuff. So we're going to jump right into it because, again, we don't do long intros. I don't want to do a long intro. Um, but also, before we do that, let's send a special prayer up for the baby that was found in the landfill here in Texas. They found him, the baby, he was an 18 month old little boy. They found him in the landfill here in Rowlett, Texas, which is like literally up 30 from me. It's not that far. Um, the aunt's boyfriend did something to him, and the aunt's boyfriend had already had charges against him for child endangerment. And now that this 18 month old little boy is dead, so let's send prayers towards you no, know, um his family uh not sure of all the details i just heard about it today when i got home from my little sister but i did see the amber alert last night so that's in prayers you know for the family as a whole and um find justice for him i don't know what it is with these niggas and these babies and these bitches letting these fuck boys around their babies listen that's just something that I have never done with my kids, even when they was grown. Allow different men around my kids. They only knew one somebody, and that was Carlos. And they knew him for 18 years, and still to this day, they still know of Carlos. And it's going to be like that um, with Davina. I don't take her around any of my male friends, point blank, period. This is something I don't. It's dangerous these days, these men and these kids. These niggas are killing these babies for no apparent reason. For no apparent reason. For I ain't gonna say for no apparent reason because it's always a reason. But they're killing these kids as if it's something to do. And it's not fun. It's not fair. It's not safe. So keep the fuck boys away from your babies. Boys and girls. Because these fuck niggas don't give a fuck if they boys or girls. So let's just send a special prayer for this little 18 year old month. Eight month old little boy and his family as a whole. Don't know the full details of it yet. Um, but you can always Google 18 month old little boy found in a landfill here in Raleigh, Texas. And I'm sure it'll, if it ain't already in your hometown, because my mom knew about it with, in Louisiana. So that's, I'm sure that it's nationwide. So let's just do that. Um, and let's go on to the video so the first thing that i'm going to show is going to be this cute little bracelet um it reminds me or give me like an african thing um bracelet yeah if i go see lion king i wear this it's remind it gives me that lion king black panther african thing and it is a uh, magnetic closure this one that was a dollar ninety eight. I just took the sticker off of that. Y'all know it ain't no video unless I'm dropping something. If I ain't dropping something, it's not a video. Um, I got these glasses. These was a dollar ninety eight too. Um, just pulled the sticker off of these and wiped these off. I like them. Just as soon as Shay sees them, I won't have them. But I like them. So we got those. Just as soon as she see them, I won't have them. Um, going right into bags. I got this cute little. This is a Lauren Conrad full fur circle little crossbody bag. I thought that this was really cute. I have some um blush colored booties and a blush colored colored fedora hat that's gonna go perfect with this, and it gives you. So you can't see it, but the hardware is rose gold. Yeah. Well, nothing wrong with this little bag. But, again, this is, I think I got this one last month. I think I probably showed y'all this. If I did, overlook it. Fast forward. This is a um, little charge it pouch. You put your charger and cards and stuff for your charger in here it even say charge it 
right there. This is a zipper pocket. This is a zipper pocket. And I'm assuming you will put your, like, your little um, USB thing, little charger in there and run your cards and put your phone in here. Keep your phone in here while it's charging. So, I got this to throw in my purse. Um, also, I got this cute little... I guess this will be a car holder, coach car holder with the red or burgundy trimming. Also has a pocket right here in the back. I kept the ticket in this because ain't nobody gonna believe how much I paid for. And we got this at the 4th of July when the whole entire store was 50% off. So I got 50% off of 298 $2.98 with 50% off. And it is a coach, cute little coach. Car holder, you can you know put your keys on here. Let's go. Why we still in that coach thing? I got this cute little coach, like a um cute little bucket bag. Um, they did have a cute bucket bag in that store today. It was black with gold um garments, and then the inside was red. I didn't get it, but um. I got this coach. This was $14.91. Coach. Little coach bag. It's not even dirty. I mean, the outside of it don't have any stains on it. The corners are in good condition. And the strap feels like good leather. And then it also has the toe tag on here that says coach. This is my first coach bag. But what, Well, no, I'm lying because I got a coach crossbody but this would have been my third coach bag if I would have got that other coach bag that I saw some months ago but I didn't get it but yeah I got this one and zipper in the back and this is gonna go in there so so I got that let's jump into some belts oh before we do that let's go into some shoes I got these these are some Sam Edderman leopard print wedge booties um Sam Edmonds. Y'all know that I have leopard print loafers by Sam Edmonds. So we got these with the zipper detail in the front. And they feel so good. This calf hair feels really, really soft. And I cannot wait to style these this coming season. While we still on the Sam Edmonds trend, I got these snake print. But they look like they olive. I don't know, but they look olive to me. But these are some snake print uh, sandals. They say that they are nine and a half, but they fit me perfect. And I don't wear nine and a half. I'm an eight and a half to a nine. I don't wear half. I don't wear nine. I only get um, a size nine so I can have that extra room in the toe area. I don't like my toes to be like this. I like my toes to, you know, be able to do that. I'm just saying. But we got these. Sam Edmonds. Okay, that's all that I got yeah. for shoes, believe it or not, because I really don't need no shoes. I'm, I'm going to be giving away some shoes. I got some stuff in the storage that I'm going to be giving away. I'm tired of looking at it. Let's jump into the belt section. So we got this belt. This belt is a uh, Betsy Johnson with the leopard print in the inside and it can be it's an adjustment belt which is cool because my waist is really not that big my waist isn't um a wide waist my I can wear a 30 32 33 in the waist or 30 depending on who made it if it's like something from um Old, old Navy, I can wear 30, but anything else, I can do a 32, 33. But it has this cute buckle detail, and it has Bessie Johnson right there. And I thought that this would be really cute this upcoming winter with a oversized cardigan or a uh, one of my uh, day trench coats or something or a sweater or something. I thought that this, even on top of a denim shirt, I thought that this would be cute. This upcoming winter, and again, this is a Betsy Johnson, and it was really cute. This next belt is this belt. It's black with the 
silver studs and the uh, um, buckle. There, this is a Perry Ellis belt and it's genuine leather. Yeah, so I got this belt. Again, this is something that I could, you know, wear with some wear looped in some jeans with a shirt tucked in just so you can see the belt and some old and boots or some tennis shoes or something. This is going to be cute to my collection. And I do need to do a belt collection because I got some more belts over there. Um, I got this belt. It's black with the chain detail. This belt has some nice little weight to it too. This is a nun name brand belt with uh, silver details, as you can see in the bulk. It's really cute, too. So, we got this belt. And this next belt, I didn't know what it was, y'all. I didn't know what it was, so I got it home and wiped it down with the Clorox wipe. You know, to, I, I cleaned everything. Belts, bags, earrings, clothes, shoes. Hey, anything I get from the thrift store, I'm cleaning. If I can throw it in the washing machine, I'm going to throw it in the washing machine. If I have to spray it with Lysol and wipe it down, and I'm clean everything you get from the thrift store. I don't give a fuck what it is. Even if it's brand new with tags, clean it. But I saw this belt. This is what I saw. The double buckle with the gold hardware. This is what I saw. I didn't, you know, I didn't know what I had until I got it home. And look in the inside. Y'all may not be able to see this. But it is a YSL belt. There's the serial, serial number. It's a made in Italy. And y'all really can't see. It is a YSL belt. On the real real, they're selling this belt for $175 for this belt. I paid $1.98 for this belt. A dollar period nine eight for this belt. It's crazy. If you're not thrifting, I don't need for y'all to get on it. Look at this. So now I can wear my YSL perfume and my YSL belt. It'd be fabulous, baby, on the low low. On the only somebody that knows they name brand is going to ask me or stop and say, is that a YSL belt? Girl, yes. Must be nice. It is, girl, on a thrift budget, baby. Listen, let me tell you. Ain't nobody got time to be playing with y'all. But look at this goodness. Yeah. So, this was an amazing, amazing find. I'm still going to do my um, quote-unquote thrifted luxury haul yeah that's what i'm gonna name it my thrifted luxury haul and that way i can you know recap some of the name brand stuff that i have thrifted i still got stuff in the storage that i need to go and check on but yeah so that's the end of this video y'all hopefully i can get one more out if i can do three for the night then i'm doing amazing because i still i got clothes over there that i can really show you guys i think i'm gonna wait till the vino go to sleep so that way you know, we can roll into it. So, until the next video, you guys. Bye.